Morning Crew. This month, we are talking about be considerate. Now, what are some ways that we can be considerate to the people around us? There are plenty. Don't worry if you can't think of any right now. I'll give you some examples to get the ball rolling. After going through these examples, you should have an idea about how to be considerate to people in your own way. First thing to do is to look at your surroundings. You got to take a look around. If you're in the library, is it considered to act like you're at a football game? Woo! Probably not. You have to jump into the shoes of the people around you and figure out if what you're doing is appropriate for where you are at. As they say, there is a time and place for everything. In the middle of a movie, if you're texting on your phone, that could be kind of distracting. Same thing with snacks. Opening snacks with wrappers and bags can be noisy. A considerate thing to do would be to turn off your phone and open these snacks before the movie starts. Next, we have impact. Everything we do has an impact. Pause and think about the impact you make when you do something. If you cut someone in line, is that fair to the people behind you? What about the younger students? They may be looking to you as an example. Without knowing, you affect people around you through the choices you make. So be aware and think about how to be considerate. Last, we have watch yourself. Watch yourself not only means that you watch your actions, it means that you are on time. Being on time shows that you are considerate because you are respecting the schedules of the people around you. If you show up late to class, you may disrupt the lesson. If you show up late to practice, you may hold back the progress of the team because they need you there in order to run plays or set formations. If your team had to stay later because you showed up late, is that fair to your teammates? These are things to think about to make us better people in the long run. Kind decisions require this type of thinking, but the more we practice, the more natural it becomes to act in line with the pledge. All right, so we talked about how to look at our surroundings. We talked about how our actions impact the people around you. I think you are all ready to put this into action. It's your turn to come up with some examples. I have to go, but remember that you can add to this list whenever you want. If you come up with a way to be considerate, I want to hear about it. Send me a message on our Facebook page or Instagram page. Be sure to include my name, Alex in your comment or post. Keep up the good work and I'll catch you later. Alex signing out. Bye.